Just never get tired of hearing Luther Van Dross. Never too much, of course. Thanks to Marcus Miller on the amazing thwacking bass. Oh, I got away with that one. All right. So, all right. In the meantime, uh, oh, by the way, got one more Luther track to play right at the end of the show. In the meantime, yes, it's our triple F time. And this week, we are going to go to Italy. Sono italiana. Ed ora, signore e signori, è il momento del film straniero nel programma radiofonico di Dave Lowen. <laughs> Lowen! <laughs> Let's get those bongos going! Come on! Here we go! All right! Hit me! All right, so it's our triple F. We've got Mike the producer. Mike, you here? Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Buongiorno. We are in Italy this week, all right? So uh, going to the keeping with the Oscars theme, all right? This week is an Italian film which is up for one of the best songs in the Oscars, all right? So uh, let's go into it. It's called The Life Ahead, all right? It's called The Life Ahead. Oh, okay, and here's the premise. All right, so here we go. It's an aging Holocaust survivor forges a bond with a young immigrant from Senegal who recently robbed her. All right, that's it. That's the premise. Lead actress, her, is played by the amazing Sophia Loren. All right, Mike, what do you think? I enjoyed it. I thought it was a little bit of a slow burner to start with. Yes, I know but what you mean. I did get into it and I got fully engaged at the end of it and I did enjoy the end. Okay, all right, good one. All right, so just to say, Sophia Loren, yes. iconic movie star. And here she is. She's what, how old? 86 years old. And look, looking her age, I think. What do you think? I thought she looked good. You look good? Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. So, uh, um, an interesting enough, actually, what is uh, is her son is Eduardo Ponti. He directed the film. Ah, all right. So, yeah. So, okay. So, what did you like about the film, Mike? Um, I thought it was a nice sort of story. I liked the the young boy that plays the the kid from Senegal. He was great. He I does thought. well, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He yeah. does well. A little rough around the edges, like as a film in general. But yeah, it was. there were sweet bits. You know, towards the end, I was like, you know, I really enjoyed the end of it. I liked how they wrapped it all up. Yeah, yeah. It was, it was, it was good how that, how they do that with regarding to, and like Sophie Loren. I mean, she still kind of has it. She's got a screen presence, yeah. isn't yeah, she? Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Yeah. What, what's kind of interesting? I was reading how because of COVID, they were going to have this massive launch of the film in Rome. Okay. All right. Because of COVID, they couldn't, so they had it basically in Sophie Loren's front room <laughs> in her house in Geneva. Her and oh. her son oh. uh, watching it on Zoom, and so. Uh, so that was it but this like massive iconic star and it says I think it's a good quote saying um, she's still big even though the picture's got smaller isn't that a good little quote that's actually quite appropriate yeah good one alright so so what would you give it out of 10 Mike I think I think a 7 you seven. give it a seven? Yeah. All right, look, I haven't really given my opinion of me. I, look, I thought it was an okay film, yeah. to be honest. Uh, I would give it actually probably a six. Mm. I would kind of like, it was an okay film. You're right, the young kid, the Senegal kid played it well. Sophia Loren, I think I was quite shocked at just how how old she is. Uh, you know, yes. but she is 86. Yeah. And um, and I know it's, it's really tricky about some of these iconic, amazing actors and actresses getting parts in... In, in their uh, in their old age, yeah, yeah. But I mean, she did well, and as I said, it's up for yeah, yeah. Thank you. It's up for an Oscar. <laughs> <laughs> but it's uh, the Oscar is for uh, for best song. By the way, something else I wanted to say was in Italian. It's called the film's called The Life Ahead, and I think actually, by the way, how can it be seen? Oh, it was on uh, Netflix. It was on Netflix, yeah, wasn't it? Was on it? Netflix, yeah. All right. So in Italian. Uh, the life ahead is La Vita de Venti Asse. All right. The reason why I would say that is it's funny because Italians, it's like if you 
if you want to kind of make we, we we sort of makes it sound so British, but if we kind of Italianize it, we need to kind of use our hands, and we kind of like got to sort of talk as if we're we're on a roller coaster ride. So it's it's la vita davanti a se. I mean, how would you say, it, Mike? Like that? Yes, you would. <laughs> you're good at accents, mate. <laughs> speaks, speaks louder than words. Accents, speak. <laughs> All right. So in the meantime, got a link song. Always play something connected with the song. Now look, it's down for the Oscar for best song. So thought we better play you the song. All right. It's by Laura Pasini. Well, you feel I- like no one understands. 